Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we are going to solve one very interesting and challenging question from Math Olympiads. We have to solve for the real values of x. So let's get started. We can write here radicand must be greater than or equal to 0. Here also x plus 1 must be greater than or equal to 0. So we can write our conclusion x must be greater than or equal to negative 1. Now here we have 17 which will be splitting as 16 plus 1. And in this radicand we have 5 which we are going to write 1 plus 4 or 4 plus 1. So let me write our equation square root of 17 plus x. I can write x plus 1 plus 16. Then we have minus 8 times is square root of x plus 1 plus is square root of 5 plus x. We will write x plus 1 plus 4. Then we have minus 4 times is square root of x plus 1 equal to 6. Now we can write x plus 1 in both the radicands. Here we have and here we have. This will be a square root of x plus 1 and then we will put whole power 2. A square root and a square will be over. We will get x plus 1. Plus 16 is 4 square minus 8 we can write 2 times 4. Then we have a square root of x plus 1 plus a square root of, again we will do the same thing, a square root x plus 1, whole a square, then 4 is a square of 2, minus 4 is 2 times 2, a square root of x plus 1, RHS is 6. Now if I will consider a square root x plus 1 equal to a and 4 equal to b. Here also a square root x plus 1 equal to a and 2 equal to b. Then I can write here a square root of a square plus b square minus 2ba or ab. Here also we will write a square root of a square plus b square minus 2ab. So we are getting one algebraic formula in our radicands. So we will write here a minus b whole square because a square plus b square minus 2ab is a minus b whole square. So we can write our equation a square root of square root of x plus 1 minus 4 whole square plus the square root of the square root of x plus 1 minus 2 whole square equal to 6. Now we will cancel square root and square because we know that square root of a square, this is equal to modulus of a or mod a or absolute value of a. So we will cancel a square root with a square and we will write here mod of a square root x plus 1 minus 4 plus mod of a square root x plus 1 minus 2 equal to 6. Now this is the mod equation which we are going to solve as per cases. If I will draw one number line where I will write a square root x plus 1 then we have two points to demonstrate. First one is 2, second one is 4. So we will deal in this segment or in the domain once 
square root of x plus 1 is less than 2. Second segment is once square root of x plus 1 is lying in the interval 2 and 4. And third one is once x plus 1 with square root is greater than 4. So let us consider our first case. I will write our equation first. The square root of, here it is. So our first case is square root x plus 1 is less than 2. So we can conclude here our first mod. Once the square root x plus 1 is less than 2, this would be negative. And second mod square root x plus 1 minus 4 would be negative as well. So we will write here 2 minus the square root of x plus 1 plus 4 minus the square root of x plus 1 equal to 6. Or we can write 6 minus 2 square root x plus 1 equal to 6. Now we will subtract 6 from both the sides and write minus 2 times the square root of x plus 1 equal to 0. Now we will divide our equation by minus 2 both sides. We will get square root x plus 1 equal to 0. Now we will square both sides and write x plus 1 equal to 0 or our first answer x equal to minus 1 will be here. Now we will consider our case second where square root x plus 1 is lying in the interval 2 and 4. Let me write here case number 2. This is square root x plus 1 is in the interval of 2 and 4. So our equation was mod square root x plus 1 minus 2 plus mod of square root x plus 1 minus 4 equal to 6. If square root x plus 1 is in the interval 2 and 4, then I can say the second modulus would be negative and first modulus would be positive. So I will write square root x plus 1 minus 2 plus minus of square root x plus 1 minus 4 equal to 6 or I can write square root x plus 1 minus 2 minus square root x plus 1 plus 4 equal to 6. Now square root x plus 1 with negative square root x plus 1 will give us 0. 4 minus 2 is 2. As 2 cannot be equal to 6, we will write here no solutions or no real solutions we will find from here. Now let us consider equality at these two points also, 2 and 4. Now we will discuss the case number 3. So case 3 is when a square root x plus 1 is greater than 4. Again, we will write our equation mod of square root x plus 1 minus 2 plus mod of square root x plus 1 minus 4 equal to 6. If square root x plus 1 is greater than 4, then first mod would be positive, second mod will also be positive. So I can write here square root x plus 1 minus 2 plus square root x plus 1 minus 4 equal to 6. Or we can write 2 times square root of x plus 1 minus 6 equal to 6. Now we will take minus 6 to the RHS. 
we will write 2 times square root x plus 1 equal to 12. Now we will divide both sides by 2. So square root x plus 1 equal to 6. After squaring both sides, we can write x plus 1 equal to 6 square or 36. Now we need to subtract 1 from both the sides and write x equal to 35. So we have in total two solutions x equal to negative 1 and x equal to 35. Now we are going to cross verify. So I will write here check the solutions. So our first solution was x equal to negative 1. Equation is here. So we will begin with LHS. So I will write a square root of 17 plus x. So 17 minus 1 minus 8 times square root of minus 1 plus 1 plus a square root of 5 plus x. So 5 minus 1 minus 4 times square root of minus 1 plus 1. So square root of minus 1 plus 1, this will give us 0. Here also 0. So we will write here square root 17 minus 1 is 16 plus square root 5 minus 1 is square root 4, which will give us 4 plus 2. And 4 plus 2 is 6. 6 is our RHS. Hence, we can conclude x equal to negative 1 is our solution. Now, we will cross-examine x equal to 35. So, we will write our LHS as a square root of 17 plus x. So, 17 plus 35 minus 8 times square root of x plus 1. So, we will write 35 plus 1 plus a square root of 5 plus x. So, 5 plus 35 minus 4 times square root of 35 plus 1, which we will simplify and write a square root of 17 plus 35. Here, we will write 52 minus 8 times square root of 36 plus square root of 40 minus 4 times square root of 36. Now square root of 36 is 6. So we can write 52 minus 8 times 6 plus square root of 40 minus 4 times 6. Now we know that 8 times 6 is 48, 4 times 6 is 24. So we will write a square root of 52 minus 48 plus a square root of 40 minus 24, which will give us a square root of 4 plus a square root of 16 equal to square root 4 is 2, square root 16 is 4, we will get some 6, which is our RHS. Hence, solution x equal to 35 is also verified and true solution. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.